In this video, we'll see something uh, next important topic that is module page settings. When I say module page settings, what is exactly the page here? This area of portion which you can see that is nothing but a page. So now if I want to customize the page or if I want to add and remove the columns, how do I change it? Right? So this is the page. I'll show you how to customize. Now, where does I, where do I find out the module page settings? If I keep my cursor at this location, it says as configure page settings. So I usually call it as module page settings. Now, if I want extra space to be allocated for this model page settings or model page, I can just minimize this area. Okay, this area I can reduce. So if you want to hide both sides bar, you can use the shortcut key Alt Shift and M. So this area will get hidden, hide and this also will get hidden here. So if I press Alt Shift and M from my keyboard, you see both went and I'm getting maximum space. Now I can configure the page settings here. Now if I, what I mean by page settings is, now if you see I have all the headings given and the text and different types of artifacts. What if I want only headings, the first level headings. So if you see introduction, that's the first level. Second level is business goal and third level is somewhere as vision statement. So if I want only three levels, these main level itself. So I can just click on this place, model page settings. And you see there's an option as show full hierarchy and I'll say as show level one. So this way you see there's a level one hierarchy which is given here. Now if I want to see only level one, level two, both of them. So I'll just click on this place, show level one instead of that, I'll say as show two levels. Now if you observe here, after one, 1, 1.1, after two, there's nothing given. So after three, there is 3.1. So I can keep on seeing getting the levels of each artifact, right? So I'll just go to this place now. Again, if I want, I can just keep on seeing as show levels, show three levels. So if you observe 2.1, 3.1, all these three levels are given here. Yeah, so these are given, these keeps on changing according to your level hierarchy. Now, if you do not want this three or two levels, you can just say as I want to see the entire full hierarchy. So I'll say as show full hierarchy. So entirely you'll get entire details itself. So all details will be shown it itself. Now, the next thing is if I want columns less or more, for example, I have the artifact type. What if I want one more column so I can add one more column here, that's attribute column. So I'll just click on this place and I can say as configure columns to display. So if I click on configure columns to display, it says right now these are the columns visible and that is the width of the column which is visible right now. So what if I want to add some more columns from this left hand side, I can pick up and I can add the columns here. Let's say if I pick up some column as status, status column I'll pick up, click on add. So status column is added. And if you want, you can change the width of the column. I'll just change it to let's say 400 and I'll click on OK. So once I click on OK, so the 300 width changed to 400 and also I've got the column which is of status. Right now the status column is totally empty, so I cannot change anything here. So same way you can keep on adding multiple columns and you can change the row height or you can say column width itself. Next is that was the long cut method, but if you want a shortcut method, these are the uh, attributes or you can say different columns which you want to show. If I click on this primary text, I'll get one more column that is nothing but a primary text. So this way you can find out and the last option if you see there is more option given. If I click on more, it will take me to this configure columns to display the same place which I have left earlier. That's one change column display setting itself and you can find out that is one part. But if you want to manually increase or decrease the column width itself, you can just keep your uh, cursor between the column widths column headings and you can expand or if you want you can shrink the uh, column width itself. So this way, this way we can see we can customize the configure page setting itself. That's all for this video.